I knew Apple was gonna play a game. I personally am surprised that they're going as low as they're going. They are working so hard to do this union busting, but now it's getting to a point where it's kind of nasty. <laughs> it, it blows my mind and it, it's honestly disgusting to me. facing union busting tactics? 100%. Every day, all day, someone's always off the floor. We always are lacking people because of these meetings. It always ends up being why you shouldn't vote yes for the union. Hey guys, Apple provides a lot of benefits. Like this is what you should be grateful for. And it may be two or three sentences of that and then it goes right into just straight union busting. Why are you unionizing? This is a bad idea. Deirdre O'Brien walking into our store um, after we go public is definitely an intimidation factor. Um, she came to our store, walked through, stayed for a little while, took some pictures and left and went along with her day. The video that she came out with was after her coming into our store. I cherish the relationship that we have, which I feel could fundamentally change if a store is represented by a union under a collective bargaining agreement. I'm about what it would mean to put another organization in the middle of our relationship. <laughs> I couldn't uh, really sit through all of it. Um, all of us were very surprised um, and just kind of disgusted by just the open misinformation. This is what they're gonna try to say. They're, they're gonna harp on the fact that there's a third party coming in. This is not a third party, it's us. It sucks that they're working so hard to try to scare people, especially because we've been working so hard trying to figure out exactly how to make our lives at the store better and doing it the way Apple wanted us to do it wasn't working. So we have to take matters into our own hands because obviously you don't care about us. They're saying, you know, hey, did you look into the history of the union? Black people weren't even allowed to be there. Would you want to join an organization where black people weren't allowed? And it's, it's like anything that was founded in the 1800s, you know, black people didn't have rights, so. so. There are a lot of black folks in our store. Um, and I think that certain leaders think that was like an in for them uh, to be able to be like, well, I'm black and I don't think that you should be doing uh, the union. How does that make you feel? Oh, I hate it. I absolutely hate it. I feel disgusted. And as a black person that works there, I've literally told a manager that I feel like tactics like that are disgusting. It's disgusting to me. It's 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 gross. It feels as though them trying to pull this card is kind of discrediting the work that we've put in to get to this point. I will say Apple did, has done a, a good job of getting people to kind of waver. Um, but they haven't shaken the core foundation. I'm definitely voting yes uh, for the union this week. I love my job, but there's things that we can do better. So why not, why not change it? Why not do better? We live in a state that's one of the wealthiest states and we work for one of the most profitable companies in the world. So I just feel like it's kind of fair for us to be able to afford where we live. For us, it, like to be the first Apple store to unionize, it's like a history-making event, number one. The first store in the nation, a $3 trillion company, it's like, it's not something you would have thought of. But we're, we're absolutely not gonna be the last. There's a wave coming. If you're feeling like a union is the best thing for you, for your store, go for it. Like, it's gonna be scary. But I feel like if we didn't take that step, a lot of things that we're getting now would have never happened. This will give us a lot more of a say and a lot more of just that warm feeling of walking into the store and knowing like, yeah, we, we did this.